in my opinion, this is not the way, and it was very clear in the statement, this is not the way to best protect uh, uh, the US or any other country uh, in relation to the uh, serious concerns that exist about possibilities of terrorist infiltration, but I don't think this is the effective way to do so, and uh, I think that uh, these measures should be uh, removed sooner rather than later. That was the appeal I made. I think uh, that uh, those measures indeed violate uh, uh, our basic principles, uh, and I think that they are not effective if the objective is to really uh, avoid terrorists to enter the United States. So I strongly hope that uh, the U.S. Uh, will be able to uh, uh, re-establish its very solid refugee protection in, in resettlement, and I hope that the Syrians will not be excluded in that process. In relation to uh, a possible visit in the phone call I had with President Trump, uh, uh, it was uh, clearly agreed that uh, at the adequate moment uh, I would have a visit to Washington uh, to also uh, visit him. That is absolutely normal uh, and it will naturally happen. Um, uh, we had a very constructive discussion with uh, the American ambassador on the cooperation between the US and the UN. And uh, you know, um, uh, sometimes we talk too much about things that have not happened. And when you talk too much about things that have not happened, you trigger the happening of those things. 